getting hoppy. We're making ourselves a smash ale for the very first time. Single malt on this will be a German Pilsner and the single hop is a Hollertal Blanc. 16 liters of water, heated that up to a target temperature of 66. Added our grain pipe so it would heat up at the exact same time. And when we hit our target temperature, started adding in our grains. Had slightly under five kilograms of grain, so I added in about roughly a kilogram at a time. And I make sure in between addings that I'm stirring it with my steel mash paddle and making sure that it's fully hydrated and there are no dry spots or clumps or anything. I'm getting the max amount of sugar out of this. Granted, this is not the most exciting part of the process. Eh, but it smells good. Kind of makes you feel like you're doing something, too. <laughs> so, still stirring. But once she's stirred up, I'm going to put the follower on it and then get the recirculating pump going with a light flow. That way, there's always water flowing through the mash. So I ran this for about 65 minutes. which point, shut off the recirculating pump, removed the hose and valve, and then lifted the mash pipe out and just let it drain. Heated up 16 liters of water to 77 degrees for my spargin. One jug at a time, nice and hot, making sure we get every bit of sugar out of those grains. Want this to be as beery as possible. So I ended up with seven gallons. I know during the boil I'm gonna lose a bit of that, but I hope I get a little over six, hopefully six and a half. Hop schedule, pretty easy on this one. It's a single hop, all holler tall blanc. One ounce at 60 minutes, one ounce at 15 minutes, and one ounce at mash out. That's a simple schedule there. At 60 minutes, we added in the first batch of hops and started the timer. Got the recirculating pump going once again, just to make sure that the water's flowing through nicely, pulling stuff from the bottom, taking it up to the top. At 15 minutes, added the second batch of hops, added an Irish moss tablet to help with the clarification of the beer. And at zero minutes, added in my last batch of hops. Put in the cooling coil and brought it down to 23 degrees in about 30 minutes. Had a pH of 5.30 and a specific gravity of 1.050. Might even be 051. Color is great on this, looking a lot paler than the last batch. So we stirred it up, aerated it nicely, getting it ready for the hop yard ale yeast. There we go. Yeast is pitched. Twelve hours later bubbling away, and I gotta say, perhaps the most active fermentation I've ever seen. Granted, I haven't seen a lot, but I haven't seen something dancing like this. There's a party going on in there. Can't wait to try this one. Holler Wow Smash Ale.